What's up everybody, Stacking Surfer here, your favorite YouTube stacker, back with another awesome video from the beach. Um, today, we're gonna talk about Appmex, the bullying card, and Black Friday. How can you make money from them, and how can you master them? Hit it. Stacking Surfer, I'm your best friend. Balances in your bank, So you guys are probably asking yourself, why would I want to talk about AppMex? I know a lot of you don't like AppMex because you think it's too expensive. Well, if you think AppMex is too expensive, you're buying the wrong kind of product from AppMex, in my opinion. So, in my opinion, um, and I'm not a financial advisor, I'm a stacker, has a fair amount of experience, been doing this pretty heavily for several years. Um, the reason to be at AppMex is to buy something that is collectible, something that has low mintage, something that's exclusive to them, okay? I usually don't go to AppMex to buy eagles, buffaloes, maple leaves. However, when it comes to Black Friday, I have scored some incredible deals at AppMex. So I really think you guys need to consider AppMex for Black Friday. And um, we're gonna talk a little bit about their bullying card as well and how to maximize that and how to keep yourself out of danger with it but how it can really make you some good money. Um, and we're also gonna be talking about um, how to get ready for this Black Friday coming up, okay? So let's talk about AppMex for a minute. Uh, why AppMex? Well, AppMex has a lot of selection. They've got a bigger, broader selection of coins, rounds, and bars than any other online bullying dealer I've ever been to. Um, they have a great app and a great website that makes it easy to track the metals you buy from them, okay? Um, and their value over time. So I can actually go into the app and I can see that my coins have gone up in value. Um, and now I, you know, are they really up at that value? Well, that's the value they're selling at. So, you know, it's a little questionable there, but at least it's keeping track of it somewhere. You may find them on a YouTube auction um, but, you know, you may not be able to get them for the price at, at AppMex. Um, I often see these coins on YouTube auctions going for 50% to 100% to 200% more than what you can buy them at AppMex. And I shake my head, why aren't people, why don't they have AppMex up while they're bidding on these coins? To understand what the price is, why don't they have eBay up? I don't know, people. Those are some tips right there for auctions. Um, but the main reason for AppMex is they do some killer Black Friday sales. So coming up this Black Friday, there's gonna be an opportunity to um, to buy from AppMex. And um, I think you guys need to put it on your calendar. And it's one that I would bookmark. It's one that I would go set an account up with and I'd get all your payment information ready. And I would make sure that your shopping cart is empty. And then what I would do is I'd wait for the notification. So you gotta send it for the newsletter wait for the notifications and keep looking at their site for when they're going to be announcing what um, is going on sale. Okay, so that's really what I would do to get ready for, um, for AppMex. Uh, the other thing I, I recommend is this bullying card that they have. So what's cool about the bullying card is it is a credit card. Um, if you are able to get a balance, if you're able to get a credit limit of 5,000 or more, um, it becomes a Visa signature card, which has a ton of different benefits. If you guys don't know about those, um, I recommend you look into them. They can be really good. And um, what I like about the card the most is you get, I believe it's 4% back when you're buying from the AppMex site, okay? Now you're gonna also be paying about 4% for the transaction fee. I could be wrong, maybe it's 3%. Um, I'd have to look. but um. Here's the reason I like it. If I'm able to buy a coin from them or coins from them um, and use the credit card, they send it in the next 24 to 48 hours. The coins are sent. I don't have to wait a week for an ACH transaction to go through. Um, also, I get the points, I get that 4% back in points, so I don't lose that money. Um, and I get to use it at AppMex to buy more gold and silver. And then I get like a, a percent back from anything else I buy. Now that's not huge, but I am getting real money, not fiat or some points in a program. But what's happening on Black Friday is they're giving you 5% on everything, I believe. And then they're giving you 10% back on select items. 
that's huge. And if you are someone that has an eBay store like I do, and you may be flipping some of these coins or you have auctions online on, um, on YouTube or whatnot or whatever system you may be using, um, having that credit card will get you the coins really fast. I live in California and if I buy on, buy on Black Friday, um, most of those coins will probably be showing up at my house on Tuesday, maybe Wednesday at the latest the next week. And I'll get them faster than most people that did the checking account option. Um, the other thing I like about the credit card is they do uh, special sales that are only for members. And at the end of the day, you guys, your rewards are in real money. I mean, there's not very many cards I know out there that uh, give you rewards in real money. I think there may be one or two others, but I haven't really played around with them yet. So in a nutshell, if you want to maximize Black Friday, AppMex is one of the places you should be looking at, in my opinion. I know I used the should word again, guys. Shoot. Um, and let me tell you a couple tips to get ready for AppMex. Okay, tip number one. Down dog. Get down, doggy. Get down, doggy. Mm. <laughs> All right, tip number one. Bookmark AppMex's website. Tip number two, set up an account. Tip number three, fund that account. Make sure it's linked to your bank account and to a credit card just in case. Um, if you're going to be able to buy gold or silver at spot and uh, your bank account's not working but you have a credit card loaded, it's probably still worth buying it via the credit card, even paying the fees, okay? So have, have a backup on there and then know what you want ahead of time, okay? Um, that's gonna be important. And then the last one is um, know that there's going to be a lot of people trying to buy the same stuff you're buying on Black Friday. Oh, look, there's a sunset going down, guys. And so you need to be ready. You need to be fast. You've gotta be there a few minutes before logging in, starting to put stuff in your shopping cart the minute that the site is ready for Black Friday. And then what you've gotta do is you've gotta quickly purchase. So do not, I repeat, do not go put an ounce of gold in there and an ounce of platinum if it's available and you have the money for it. And then the silver coins that you can get at a good deal and then start shopping around for other stuff. As soon as you get those Black Friday deals in your shopping cart and it's, it's giving you the option to buy, buy it. Um, they will go away fast. And I have lost stuff before over the last couple of years doing this. Um, in addition to this, I would also recommend finding a couple other stores that uh, are gonna be doing Black Friday sales and have those ready in case you're not able to make these um, or it doesn't work out for you. So at the end of the day, um, I think this is a great strategy. Uh, I had a friend tell me, don't make this video. Stackers are going to hate it because it's AppMex. I'll make it anyway because you guys need to know about it. So down below is a link to AppMex's credit card. You can go check that out. And, um, and uh, anyway, I have one. I think it's worth it. I've enjoyed it. Um, I gave one to my kids, so he makes me uh, he gets me free silver and gold just by going and getting gas and other things like that. So if you haven't done so already, please hit that subscribe button, that bell icon, and um, also the thumbs up. And uh, watch some of my other videos. I think you guys will enjoy them. I have a great interview with Andy Sheckman that just came out uh, that should have a lot more views. Um, and I guess maybe I'm not doing enough yellow journalism and um, fear mongering in my thumbnails and my title to get people to watch that. But um, it's a great video. You guys should definitely check it out. And until next time, peace out.